Best things to do in Margaret River. The Margaret River region is one of the most popular destinations in Western Australia and is world renowned for its outstanding wineries, but is an amazing place to check out. It also offers stunning beaches, natural wonders and unique landmarks. The Margaret River region is a living and breathing embodiment of ancient geography and Wadandi song lines. Natural beauty, abundance of space, fine wine and fresh coastal air make a holiday here the remedy to modern life. Located three hours drive from Perth, the Margaret River region is a heavenly slice of paradise for locals and international visitors wanting to sit back, relax and enjoy the gorgeous natural beauty and culture of Western Australia. Discover natural wonders and find out what makes this land, rich in biodiversity, so special. Go birdwatching, meet a woylie, find secret swimming spots and walk through the Boran Up Carry Forest. Make tracks for the mountain bike trails and gaze in awe at the crystal caves. Sip craft beer, gin or wine in the very place it was grown and made. Take a foodie adventure through farmers markets, in cafes, fish and chip shops, restaurants and winery dining rooms. Trust the chef, and always take the matching wine option. Watch the sunset with a picnic, this is what holiday memories are made of. With so many artists and creatives drawn to the natural beauty and great lifestyle, you'll find a vibrant arts community. Find something special in a fine art gallery, visit working studios, enjoy a live gig or cinema under the stars. Here is our list of the best things to do in Margaret River. Visit wineries on eco-friendly electric bikes. Alternatively, rather than driving, you could hop on some specialized Turbo Levo bikes which have an electric motor that gives you a bit of a boost as you pedal. The bikes allow for easy exploring of the wineries in a fun and natural environment as you roll through nature and enjoy all the great produce the Margaret River region has to offer. Easy Ride Tours offers a winery cellar door and brewery guided tour which includes a tasting and lunch. Cruise along the Blackwood River in a houseboat. Embrace the perfect getaway by taking an entire weekend aboard a houseboat and enjoying the tranquility of nature along the Blackwood River. The houseboat is easy to drive and you don't need a skipper's license, just a current regular driver's license. With no distractions or disruptions, this is one of the best outdoor activities to do in Margaret River to get away from the hustle and bustle. You can enjoy the sound of the water, different bird calls and the wind blowing in the tall trees along the banks of the river. There are a few different houseboats to choose from but all are equipped with beds, bedding, bathroom and lounge area. The lower Blackwood River is popular for water skiing, wakeboarding, fishing, kayaking, wildflowers and wildlife so bring your equipment on board to make the most of your time. Explore beneath the earth at Lake Cave. Lake Cave is an incredible crystal chamber of underground caves accessed from the floor of a sunken forest surrounded by carry trees. It's one of the coolest day trips near Margaret River. A lake inside the cave mirrors the delicate crystal formations that grow from the cave roof. It's one of the natural wonders of the area that you simply can't miss. Lake Cave is the most, actively dripping, cave in the southwest and is also the deepest of the show caves on the Lewin Naturalist Ridge. Above ground, you can enjoy the stunning scenic views from the Lake Cave Deck, a spectacular viewing platform suspended in the treetops over the sunken entry to the cave. You must take a fully guided tour through the underground caves and adventure tours depart every 40 minutes starting from 9.20am with the last tour operating at 4pm. Mammoth Cave is also nearby, and Jewel Cave is the largest show cave in the state with three massive chambers full of crystals. Jewel Cave is 25 minutes away from Lake Cave and Mammoth Cave, with Caves Road being the connecting route between them all. Definitely check them out when visiting Margaret River. Enjoy the thrill of mountain biking. The Margaret River region is considered the mecca of mountain biking in Western Australia. Riders of all abilities can find awesome scenic tracks suited to them. Beginners will enjoy Wadandi Track, a 30 km off-road trail crossing historic bridges which once formed part of the railway line to Busselton. 
Intermediate riders can check out Ten Mile Brook or Boranup Forest. There is also a plan rolling out with nearly 500 kilometers of new trails planned in the southwest so hopefully, by the time you visit, some of these mountain biking trails will be ready to go. There are also lots of trails in Woodajup National Park, formerly known as Bramley National Park. Day Trip to Hamlin Bay only a half an hour drive from town, one of the best places to visit in the Margaret River region in Western Australia is Hamlin Bay. Famous for its stingrays, Hamlin Bay has a stunning beach with white sand, turquoise waters filled and spectacular cliff walks. Spend the day in Hamlin Bay swimming, snorkeling, fishing, diving and meeting the local stingrays. When driving from Margaret River to Hamlin Bay, you'll pass through the Boranup Forest. Full of wildlife and serene nature, the Boranup Forest is a highlight of Western Australia. Just 20 minutes south of Hamlin Bay is another amazing Margaret River attraction, the Cape Lewin Lighthouse. As Australia's tallest mainland lighthouse, the Cape Lewin Lighthouse is a fun stop for the whole family while driving around Western Australia. Turn this day trip into a mini road trip through the Boranup Forest and to the lighthouse in addition to Hamlin Bay. It's a gorgeous corner of Western Australia that makes an easy excursion from Margaret River. Whale watching in winter. From June to December, the Margaret River's waters are host to 35,000 whales migrating from the Antarctic each year. If you're lucky, you can see whales without a whale watching tour. Head to the shore along the Cape to Cape Track or from the top of a lighthouse and you might spot some whales breaching in the distance. Alternatively, you can also go on a whale-watching cruise departing from Augusta, Dunsborough or Busselton throughout the season. A whale-watching tour is the best way to guarantee whale sightings, as you'll be with a knowledgeable local guide. This is one of Margaret River's best options for adventure tours. Walk through Boranup Carry Forest. A bushwalk through Boranup Carry Forest will take you into a stunning and quiet area surrounded with towering carry trees, some over 60 meters high, and make you feel like you're in a jungle elsewhere in the world. The Boranup Forest is also home to shady peppermint trees, wildflowers, orchids and fungi as well as some iconic Australian wildlife like the kookaburra. It's a gem of the Margaret River area. Be sure to bring your camera, some water and your walking shoes as you enjoy the natural wonders and the serenity of Mother Nature. Another option for exploring nature is Bramley National Park. Bramley National Park is a stunning area just north of Margaret River Township which has been renamed to Woodajup National Park in recognition of the Aboriginal heritage of the area. There are lovely walking trails and mountain biking trails here where you can spot local flora and fauna. Go on a coastering adventure. What happens when you blend rock hopping, beach scrambling, swell riding and even rock jumping? Coastering apparently. This epic aquatic adventure is perfect for adrenaline junkies and anyone game to try something new and fun in Margaret River. You'll discover wildlife and beautiful scenery from a different perspective as you scale along the coast in your wetsuit, life jacket and helmet. Being the only coastering company in Australia, Margaret River Adventure makes sure that you'll get to explore the Indian Ocean up close and in a unique, fun and safe way. The adventure starts in Ingari Marine Park and from there, you'll scramble and jump your way around the rocks across the natural canal. Depending on the season, you may even see wildlife like whales and sea lions. Take a surfing lesson. You are, after all, visiting one of the stops on the World Championship Tour. Just outside of town you'll find amazing waves to suit any level and you'll definitely find a beach perfect for beginners too. You can take group or private lessons and enjoy an awesome morning out on the water. Even if you don't need a lesson but you want to surf, the top beaches for surfing and relaxing in the area include Preverly Beach, Narabup Beach, and Meelup Beach. Meal Up Beach doesn't get many big waves, but it's one of the most beautiful Margaret River beaches. Learn how to kite surf. Despite the Margaret River region being known for its epic surfing, there are flat water locations in the region which allow for complete newbies to kite surfing to learn. 
Book a discovery or beginner program which includes all your gear and safety equipment and spend two hours learning what you need to get started. For those more experienced, Margaret River offers some great locations to progress or challenge yourself further so bring your gear along and get kiting. Wine and Row There is, in fact, a river in Margaret River and you can go on kayaking and winery tours which take you on a kayaking adventure in the morning before spending the afternoon enjoying fine wine. With a flexible schedule that can be tailored to suit your preferences, your guide will discuss the range of winery, scenic and gourmet food options available to find the best tour for you. As you row down the river and experience the natural beauty of Margaret River, you'll have the chance to spot local wildlife in the water while also enjoying the different bird species in the area. The clear, pristine water also offers a wild swimming experience like no other.